Hey guys, what's happening? This is Carolina Milan and right now I am stuck in traffic which by the way doesn't happen to me that often because I don't have a job so I don't commute so I don't drive when everybody's driving um, but today I had to come to Santiago which is the capital of Chile and just as any big city it's just traffic is horrible so I kind of feel for the people around me because I know these people um, probably go through this every single day Monday to Friday and I am grateful that I don't that I don't have to uh, go through this all the time so I, I take it you know I take it lightly I guess it's not that bad anyway it's a bit dark so I really hope you guys can still see me I mean, if I turn on this like maybe maybe you'll see me then but it's actually better without that anyway in today's video what I what I wanted to talk to you guys about is a giving back giving back to other people and I don't just mean giving back uh, when it comes to money or or, or material things um, I mean giving back your knowledge if you're an entrepreneur and and if you're like me then there's a big chance that you have learned so much over the past few months years however long you've been into entrepreneurship specifically marketing digital marketing um, so there's a big chance that you have a lot of knowledge accumulated inside of you and I bet I'm willing to bet that you haven't even implemented everything you have learned over the years and I also bet that you don't have the results that you wish you had simple answer is you're probably not giving back and when you give back things can keep coming to you and I have been able to, to prove that in my own experience I give back as much as I can of course there's always a limit to how much we can give back to people especially when we do it for free when we do it willingly uh, just to help others and what I think you need to think about is are you still just in the learning side of the equation are you, are you just are you still learning 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 buying courses buying programs attending seminars taking notes what what are you doing with these notes it's a big question I have I have a ton of, uh, of little notebooks with all my notes that I've taken over the years and I'll tell you I started getting deeply into marketing in 2008 after I got out of university so I've been taking notes for <laughs> about six years um, and I have I've already come to a point and I hope you come to that point too in your life and your career that I mean where where I want to do something with these notes and basically what I'm telling you to do is to create a training to create a product to create a coaching program whatever that is that helps you help other people I said there's a limit as to how much you can give because of course we have lives we have time that is limited for most of us so it would be naive to think that you can just go and help all these people um, one by one you just can't and I don't expect you to now the problem is a lot of people will expect us to help them one-on-one -on -one. so the next thing we can do is provide value in a way that helps more than one person at once if you know what I mean what I'm suggesting you guys do is first of all think about how you can move from the learning side to the teaching side you know where you can teach others all that stuff that you know you can either charge for it you can give it away as a bonus to, to people who decide to work with you in your business, to people who hire you for whatever. And, and that way it will make it easier for you and it will also make it easier for people because now they will be getting tremendous value from you and they'll be able to go through it over and over again if you decide to record the videos, if you decide to uh, do a podcast, anything. And the other great thing, I mean, not only you're helping people, you're helping yourself too. 
think about yourself too um, there's nothing wrong with that there's nothing wrong with thinking about yourself and what it, this would be doing for yourself would be um, would help you build brand equity it would help you build a long-term asset which is your personal brand be it your personal brand or your company's brand however you decide to name it uh, but the whole point here is that you do something good with all this knowledge so guys it's getting really dark so I don't know how this video is gonna turn out um, I'm about to hit the highway now the, the, the traffic jam is, over, is almost over so thank you so much for watching this video um, I look forward to hearing from you I look forward to hear from you and please leave a comment and tell me what your plan is tell me if this video helped you some way tell me what ideas you have in mind to start giving back to start teaching you know to move from the learning and investing in yourself to teaching that's gonna bring you tremendous tremendous benefits and it's gonna be great for your brand equity and I almost get hit by a truck <laughs> could just yeah oh my god some people i don't know how they got their driver's license guys but yeah anyway thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next video carolina signing off <laughs>